Now we will understand the third step of the new FMEA format, which is functional analysis. So what is functional analysis? As we mentioned earlier in one of our lectures, the purpose of this particular step is to allocate the functions and requirements of both customers and other stakeholders such as legal, regulatory, design parameters and constraints, etc. and map them to the system elements. If you recollect in the structural analysis, we talked about the system elements and now we are looking at the outcome or the functions, the requirements and linking both these. That is the primary purpose of this particular step. Let's go ahead and see how this is done. A function of a system is necessarily the activity that is performed by the system or the subsystem. 